Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we are back with our steam locomotive. As you guys can see, we actually added this car at the end, which has two tank cannon turret me bobbies. And my bobbies <laughs> on the uh, on the top of it, which is uh, pretty awesome. The only thing that I would say about this is it is actually quite ugly. So what I want to do today is modify this a little bit more, try and make it look a little bit nicer, and go from there. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's get on with it. Okie dokie, so one of the things that I did actually really like about this was the idea of actually it being angled on the side. Unfortunately, it being angled on the side is also its downfall because um, you can't really make it look nice uh, in that situation. So what we'll do is we'll actually delete this big line right here uh, and we'll try and make it look nicer by going down to our microcontrollers all the way down here. Do -do 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 -do. We need armor 1x4, which that is not it. Uh, 1x4, that is also not it. Here we go. So this is how we want it to be. Uh, we're going to go ahead and grab it in the right color, which is going to be this green right here. And we're going to go ahead and attach it on there like so. Hopefully we can do this all the way down. Uh, I believe we can almost do it all the way down, but it's not quite right. Also, we need to be doing it on both sides too. So let's go ahead and undo everything we just did. Then delete it all again uh, and delete the ones above it, which is an interesting idea. Do this and this and this and this <laughs> and this and this as we go. There's going to be lots of this. Don't you worry. Uh, and then we're going to do it all again on this side. Ba 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 ba. There we go. One and two, three and four. And then do it again, do it again, do it again, and do it again. There we go. Then if we go down a little bit more, we could do one by fives. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And then do it again right here as well. One, two, three, and four. And then we need to sort out whatever's going on in the middle right here with something else. I think we might be able to still get away with doing something like this on the very end one, like this piece. Uh, so we are going to do it like this anyway. There we go. Smack that in. Yeah, I think that actually looks kind of interesting. Um, maybe even more interesting than how it did look. And we might even do it there too. Yeah. Okay, so one of the things that we do actually need to fix about this though is that we will actually need to uh, go all the way along the bottom. Uh, in order to actually make this fit in, um, all the way across to, even all the way down here, actually. So this is going to have to come all the way down to maybe even the end, but I'm thinking to about here. There we go. Then if we spawn that in, what does that look like? Yeah, okay, so now there isn't actually a behind that we can see. This is really cool. Okay, it's time! Let's go ahead and delete these guys as well. There we go, we'll do two of those, and uh, we will actually try and use these guys yet again. Uh, not entirely sure how this is gonna go though, so yeah. In fact, actually, delete that and that. Grab these guys. I think we might be able to do this. I mean, I could be completely wrong, but if we do that there and we do this here, yeah, we could get away with doing two of those, I think. Nice. Let's go on the inside, grab these color, do this, up to there, and do it again. Okay. Yep, do that. Flip it around. One and two. Do it again, just like so. One and two. Oh, that's not right. Eh, 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 eh. There we go, and yeah, I honestly, I actually really like the way this looks more. So um, we're going to do it right here as well, obviously. Delete all of these guys, yes. Go ahead and shove these in, as we should. There we go, and that's all nice, yes. Let's go ahead and grab this color. Go from there, all the way across to here, and essentially just build this in yet again. There's one and two, three and four, and that is all we need. So, now spawn it in, what does that look like? It looks weird, but it definitely adds more detail. Okie dokie, so what I did last time was I actually ended up adding a door thing uh, on here, which was uh, these guys. What I'm going to do this time is go to grey again, uh, which is of course the same. We're going to go ahead and lead it backwards to about there-ish, there we go. And we're going to go ahead and block it off with this. So the, uh, the train tracks can actually still turn sideways, which is of course um, the issue that we ended up running into last time. We're going to go ahead and go to here again, uh, like this, there you go, we're going to do this right here, and we're going to send it from there, um, this direction, all the way to about there, I think. Actually, maybe not quite, but very close. Okay, go to here, do it one up, to there, and that's fantastic, and then we're going to do it again from this side, back over. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So go from here. Flip it around to bring it to about there. Go ahead and grab this guy. Whack it on the end. Uh, the right way up. <laughs> hopefully. And leave it there. Okay, spawn it in. What does that look like? 
Yeah, okay, way better. This is an interesting design. I'm not sure how I feel about it. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is actually delete all of these guys, and I'm going to go ahead and shove this on here, but we'll make it green, I suppose. So we're going to do this, and uh, we'll do it all along. So we'll do the same thing right here as well, up to there, and then we should be able to get away with just doing this. And also, doing this. There we go, okay, that works. Do the same thing right here as well. So on the end ones, we go all the way to the top. On the middle ones, we're just going to go ahead and do it across. There's once, there's twice, and now we are good. Yeah. Okay, I don't know whether I like it more than the other one, but we're still going to go with it. Okie dokie, next thing, we're going to go ahead and add some pivots like these ones, which go over the side and obviously dangle. Uh, we're going to go ahead and add them back in here and also here, and essentially we're going to attach those together uh, with these guys, uh, which is, of course, again, is the same thing we've added all the way down. Um, but that works. Okay, delete these ones, grab the longer ones, smash them onto there, there's one, and there's two, and that's gonna be fine. Go ahead and merge this with this one, merge that one with that one. Do the same thing right here, so these guys and these guys. There we go. Merge this with this, merge that with that, and spawn it in. Let's see what this does. Ah, <laughs> why is it gone upwards? Why would it ever fold upwards? That doesn't make any sense. Um, but if we can, let's go ahead and jump on here. Push them down. There we go. Over the side. Yeah, okay. Good. And jump up. Do the same thing. Over the side. Yeah, okay. The more random detail like this we add, uh, the better it is going to look in the end. Okay, so with that being said, let's go ahead and do something kind of crazy. We're going to go ahead and attach these guys uh, onto here. We're going to go ahead and make them this color all the way across to there. We're going to do these guys all the way across to here so that it matches up with the window. We're going to do these guys the same, and these guys, uh, again, the same. Swan it in again. Let's see what this does. All right, they folded up to begin with, but then they folded down. And I don't know how I feel about this, but let's have a little look. Push it over. There we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. Okay, so if we go on the inside, is that all a bit crazy? Probably. Uh, no, it's not too bad in here, actually. It is not too bad. Okay, so what we're going to do now is actually paint these guys uh, from here downwards to there. That's okay. Do the same thing right here down to there. And I might even just do all of this again uh, right here all the way up to the top and see what that looks like. There's a lot of seeing what things look like in this. Because uh, to be honest with you, most of it is just like a concept thing rather than a, um, I don't know, it doesn't have to look nice. It really doesn't actually. Uh, but there you go. All right, cool. I think I'm happy with this. Okay, so what I want to do now is actually go ahead and put this one next to the previous one, which is on the back of that train car, and see which one we actually prefer. I'm going to go ahead and assume it is going to be this one, but I genuinely don't know. So let me know in the comments down below whether you prefer the one with the sides looking like this, or whether you prefer the one with the sides looking like this. Honestly, I feel like this is a little bit too dull, and that one over there might actually be a little bit too, I don't know, crazy. There's a lot going on there. Um, but let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. Okay, so there we go. Very boring versus maybe a little bit too weird and crazy. I don't know. Uh, it also might be an idea to actually add these guys uh, on the next level as well for a little bit. Uh, and maybe up there as well because I feel like it just makes sense to do that in this situation. But I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about it. We're also going to have to do something on the inside very soon because that's kind of... I don't know, it's a bit crazy in there I suppose. Um, but yeah, I think, I think it all needs, it all needs looking at a little bit, I guess. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and have a little look at this. Go ahead and open up this guy. I know a bunch of you guys want automated loaders and stuff like that, but I mean, a train like this would be used by a lot of people. Um, and honestly, I feel like manually reloading is just, I don't know. It's just normal. So yeah. Anyway, uh, let's aim these to the sky. Look up to the sky and see. Okay, here we go. You ready? Three, two, one. Nice. Yeah, that's cool. That is very, very cool. Anyway, um, I think I'm actually going to go and end this video here for now. I know it's not incredible, um, but it definitely has a lot more detail than it used to. So that's good. Um, honestly, what I want to do is actually get the train on the workshop, get the train cars that I think are actually worthy of being on the workshop on the workshop too. For example, I don't think this is, and I don't think that is. Um, but I do think this train car is, 
Um, not sure about this. I feel like it's a bit wacky and weird. Um, but the tender, yes. And the locomotive itself, if it gets fixed, sure as well. Um, but yeah. Anyway, for now, thank you guys very much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of it. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.